Um, you know, anytime anyone works with Woody Allen, my reaction is I want to know everything from when you first got a phone call, did you do an audition? What was the process for you getting involved with this film? I was uh, I had been invited to the Krakow Film Festival in Poland for the last five years, like mm -hmm. since it started. I met the guys at Sundance. And so finally I said yes, and I brought my friend Jen Ruff, who's a teacher, uh, editing teacher at NYU. And uh, I was free, I was available. Uh, Juliet Taylor was on the jury with me and she's Woody Allen's casting director and she's been his casting director throughout mm -hmm. his career and they have a really uh, special relationship. So she got to know me uh, a little more at this time in my life and uh, she brought me in. Uh, I got uh, back in town on Monday. We both did. We lost our bags. We lost our bags. <laughs> And she, um, she brought me in, I got a phone call on Wednesday that I was to meet Woody at noon on Thursday. And you know, you're, you're told it's gonna be, you know, if it's seven seconds, it's, it, it doesn't mean anything. If it's, you know, it could be a minute, or, right. you know. Don't expect, a, you know, a lot. God, so nerve wracking. <laughs> um, but, you know, he is very perceptive and subtle in the qualities of what he's looking for and the chemistry between actors. Mm -hmm. So I think he knows rather quickly if, because uh, he's so instinctual and he's, he's such a master, uh, that, uh, of, what, of what the matching is. Mm -hmm. So um, I walked in and he was th there, you know. I was like, oh, hi. <laughs> because I, I'm, I'm doing, I'm, Julie, I thought I should bring you in to this part. I'm making a movie in Newport. And I was like, I know, I know. It was Joaquin Phoenix. I think he's amazing. And yeah. God, he's so wonderful and soulful. And, and, and you know, I was just kind of gushing. And he goes, uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> and I start laughing. I talk about Krakow. Mm -hmm. Uh, it was a Catholic country. I'm Southern Catholic, and there were nuns like walking around on their iPhones, and it was just such a, uh, you know, it was a trip, you know. Mm -hmm. So we talked about that a little bit, and I got a call from my my rep saying that it went well, and and um, you just like wait, and you kind of detach from, you know. Wow, so you're very zen about it. You have That's to be, yeah. Mm -hmm. And you go, okay, well, if I get cast, it's great. If I don't. That's fine. Um, I have other career options. You do. And so you just, you protect yourself. Mm -hmm. And uh, the next day I was in the dog run and I got a call and I had things to do. I had to go to Trader Joe's. And I had to like <laughs> finish making these, these pants I was making. And uh, she, I mean, it was like 10 o'clock in the morning and I say, uh, uh, Woody Allen uh, assistant, she wants to come over to deliver you pages to see if you'd like to be in, in his movie, and I just burst into tears, and uh, was just flooded with this realization of, of how uh, how risky the career of an actress is, and yeah. how much I rely on chance. And uh, I felt like, you know, I was in Vegas. I felt like a, a gambler. Wow. It's like I really, the path is really hard, and uh, I've suffered a lot over you know, unavailable parts and just the, the state of the culture and what's, what's happened to storytelling. So it, this is where I feel at home. You know, this is where I feel like satiated and grounded so that I would have this opportunity to, to, to work in, in this way. It was, uh, was a dream come true. So then after I'm like, well, I'll get, um, tell them that, uh, I got to go to Trader Joe's, and I have to go. So I'll be home around 2. <laughs> and so I did all my errands. I was home around 2. I read those pages just like, and it sounded like my voice. It, it had jokes. Mm -hmm. Well, not really jokes in it, but something about being Catholic. Um, and it, it just felt, you know, immediately I felt in place and uh what I didn't know about the about the movie was uh, 
you know, what kind of movie it was. So that was a whole other journey. And I, I also broke my wrist a week after I was cast oh and had goodness. to have wrist surergery. So, uh, yeah, it's, so there, it was that's the, the summer story. of soldiering on. That's the story. Awesome.